Here's how we can figure out which one of these fractions is larger, 3 sixteenths or 1 fourth. So you could just use a calculator, divide 3 by 16 or in 1 by 1 fourth, and then just compare the decimals. That's one way to do it. Another way to do it is if we could get the denominators here to be the same, then we could just compare the numerators. Then we'd know which fraction is greater, 3 sixteenths or 1 fourth. Why don't we take 4 and multiply 4 times 4? Because 4 times 4, that gives us 16. And up here we already have 16, so we'll keep this as 3 sixteenths. So now we have the same denominator, but down here, since we multiplied the denominator by 4, we also have to multiply the numerator by 4 as well. So 1 times 4, that would equal 4. The reason we can do that is 4 over 4, it's just 1. So we can change the value just the way it's written. 4 sixteenths and 1 fourth, they both equal 0 0.25. But now, with the same denominator, we're just going to compare the numerators. And 4 is larger than 3, so 4 sixteenths, that's larger than 3 sixteenths. And therefore, 1 fourth, that is larger than 3 sixteenths. So that's how you tell which one of those fractions is larger. I hope this helped. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.